All right, today's video, what in the world? No, that's Oopsie. Today's video, you guys gotta figure out how to just skate around, get around town. Simple stuff, back to the basics. Yes, let's do it. Hi, my name is Cody Enslow. Here on my channel, I bring you guys fun and competitive content weekly, so consider subscribing if you guys like to see that mix. <laughs> gosh guys you are just trying to ride around you need to know how to ride around on a skateboard before you can start doing these tricks I'm trying to show you first thing we're gonna do show you some tricks no 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 other way first thing we're gonna do show you how to get on a board and ride around that way you can do tricks later that sound good yeah let's do that okay all right so step one you got to find like a really good piece of uh, concrete or cement or whatever they make the roads out of or the place that you're not supposed to be on the road got some nice bumps here that just kind of everyday stuff that you guys don't want to deal with right you're kind of annoyed by it you know you're riding and then you get thrown off your board and you're like why am i thrown off my board i was just riding i was doing it a second ago you guys just hit a crack and you fall forward and it, it's embarrassing i mean it happens that you're gonna fall on skateboarding but like not like that you don't want to go down like that just over a crack right so i've been there so what i do what works super well is lifting up your foot your right foot I'm sorry your front foot just lift it up a little bit lift it up a little bit you're gonna go faster you're not gonna flip off your board so it's kind of like your first trick before you really get into ollies and stuff okay now I know what you're thinking like okay so sometimes there's just little bumps I can get through those it's fine the issue is it's usually stuff like this right so you you come up to like the very bottom of a curve so it's not that high but your back will hit, right? Whoa. Okay, you get the idea. There's a crack, it's larger than your normal just bump in the sidewalk, which also slows you down. The way you get th through those is just make sure you have enough speed, push on the board, and you're good, right? Now, there's other bumps that you need to get over that can kick your back wheels. So if you lift up the front wheels, you hit the back, it throws you that way, and which is super annoying because it works most of the time. But at some point you're gonna hit a big enough you're going to you guys are going to hit a big enough um crack at some point that's going to for sure throw you off your board what i suggest is learning an ollie but sometimes you don't know your ollies and that's okay you can still get over this stuff so i'm going to show you guys how you get through that stuff it's two parts part one you step on your board and ride around right and then you're going through the cracks and you're getting through them fine step one lean on the back of your board just lift the, the front of your board up just a titch right then shift your weight just a little bit forward to your right foot so now you're over this way or i'm sorry your front foot it's my right foot you're on your front foot and then you ride away it's that easy the back just comes with you because you're already over there i'm gonna show you guys some examples and i'm gonna run straight into this thing just so you guys can see it's it's not that bad i forgot one super big tip the main thing is confidence confidence that you are not going to fall and that your weight will solidify your groundedness um, basically when you're going through a bump you just have to be super careful because what will happen if you like get in your head like oh i don't know if i'll time this right usually you like fall or run off your board which looks just as ridiculous so wow it looks fine but basically what you want to do is just rush at it at, or at a comfortable speed right and then lift up the front like I showed you and then the back you can keep your weight about 50 50 at that point just so that way you're not like falling forward you know what I mean so that's good advice there take that put it in your pipe and smoke it <laughs> I've been watching a lot of awesome powers lately so Netflix you know That was exhilarating. 
Holy crap, that was second try. I'm pretty happy with second try. I never do that. Sometimes you just gotta go balls in, you know? And then that's how you win. I I'm going so far ahead even still. Let's take it a step back now. What I'm gonna show you guys next is just pushing, just getting around a parking lot. So really what the key is to pushing, it's not that different from what you do every day or I hope you do every day. I hope you're walking every day because all you have to do is walk. Here, I'm gonna show you guys. Watch, my feet. Step, push, walk. Wow. Walking, one foot in front of the other, right? Wow. <laughs> now it's too dark. The closer you get to going faster, the more it becomes like running. I think you guys kind of get it. So basically what's happening is I'm like, it's like I'm running, like I'm running as fast as I can on my board, but instead of like kicking my right foot, my front foot, <laughs> um, instead of kicking my right foot forward every time, um, all, all I'm doing is, I guess, leaning into it, like where you just kind of push, you know? Sorry, I'm like acting this out down here. Instead of like trying to push the board, you're running like that and stepping. It's more of like you're leaning like that and lunging. That's the word. You're lunging. Okay. Practice your lunges because skateboarding needs them. Um, but the other foot, it's like running. You just straight up are like running. I have to stop because I'm beating that de to death like a horse. Um, I didn't say it that way. All right, pretty simple. You guys get the idea. What you do is you walk around until you're comfortable running. It's like being a baby and learning how to walk. You're kind of starting as a baby. Don't wear a diaper, but <laughs> sometimes I wish I had, you know what I mean? Sometimes it's like being a baby because um, because babies can't walk. That's, that's, oh, I can't keep the camera on my face. I think it's important that you guys ollie. I'm gonna show you guys that in a video very soon. Trust me, that's just, I gotta do it. So if you guys are, are figuring it out, how to ollie, you guys, this is trash. I'm redoing this. Okay. All right, so you ollie, you get over curbs and stuff. That's like the biggest crack that you consistently have to worry about, right? Cocaine. Figure that out, your money, your cash money, you're done. For the question, just tell me, like, what do you guys trip over? It doesn't have to be about skateboarding. If you guys are tripping over stuff in skateboarding, tell me. I'll try and help you with it. If you guys are tripping, tell me what you're tripping about. Now that you guys know how to keep rolling downhill, I'm going to ask you guys one more time. Like, subscribe, follow, turn on the bell for post notifications for future uploads. And finally, let's keep rolling downhill. Uh, this week's a little different because I was experimenting a little bit and I was a little short on time. Just I had some family in town and it was a little hectic. Just uh, let me know what you guys think.